If you have a paradigm that doesn't allow you to ask questions, there's something wrong with the paradigm. And inside the traditional paradigm of Dante's Hell Inferno, you're not allowed to ask all kinds of questions. It's not a problem to ask questions, but sometimes when certain questions are asked, it's by someone who's a coward and doesn't have the conviction to declare their answer. The notion that there really isn't hell is simply a wussy effort to make God a nice guy. Can anyone really believe that Hitler's had a second chance? Okay. I don't think so. So ultimately, the panoply of scripture is pointing to one thing, and that is either reconciliation with God or separation from God. Every day. Just take a step back a little bit and hear how that sounds. You better accept Jesus Christ or you're going to burn forever in hell. Oh, God loves you. <laughs> you often find folks whose map is the territory. If you disagree with them, you're not disagreeing with them, you're disagreeing with God. I use the language of national and state borders or boundaries. I can work with anybody in the state borders, but I can't partner with anyone who's crossed a national border. I gotta tell you, that's not a good way to be. If someone's got a, a position or argument, and you think it's wrong, then why do you fear looking at it? The truth shouldn't have anything to fear. It's rather amazing to me that more people aren't saying, this can't be right. Thank you.